welcome to day 18 of Vlogmas. I am joined with Mr. Cooper this morning to help me start off this video. So this morning, like always, I have just been doing some stuff on the computer, catching up on stuff, editing videos, basically what I do every morning as far as work goes. However, this morning I dropped off Bo at like 8 a.m. He is getting groomed because he has been so, so hot. He's just panting all the time, which is also a side effect of the steroid medication he's on. But his hair is just really, really long and he needed a haircut. So I'm glad we are getting that out of the way today. He is feeling great. I'm so, so thankful for that as well. You ready to go get a haircut, buddy? Because you are mighty fluffy. Look at all that hair. We got to get some of that trimmed off just so you're a little bit more comfortable and stop panting all the time. Don't start shaking. It's going to be okay, baby. But today, I really don't know what we're going to get into. We have a couple of errands we need to run to get ready for our trip to Washington, D.C. this weekend. It's supposed to be pretty chilly, so we need a couple of warm layers to bring with us. So it should be a fun old day. I'm going to bring you all along with me. Let's get Vlogmas Day 18 started. I just filled up my cup full of ice so I can make myself some iced coffee. Look at that little Cooper Pooper. But y'all, I just had a knock at the door and I had to share what I got. This is the most extra thing I have ever seen in my entire life. You see this stocking right here? Oh, it looks unassuming, right? Well, it is a Hidden Valley Ranch stuffed stocking. This thing literally has, hold on Cooper, you're in my way. 1.59 liters of ranch dressing in it. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is absolutely hilarious. That is so funny. Cooper, you cannot eat this, honey. Whew, I think that's going to look really good hanging up with the rest of our stockings. <laughs> it's that time of the day where I go and scrounge through the fridge and figure out what I'm going to feed myself for my first meal of the day because I have had no plan this week. I've just been going and I just realized that tomorrow is Thursday and our last day in town until we leave for Washington DC for the weekend. So my schedule is just all kinds of thrown off and all of a sudden it's Wednesday and we leave in two days. So don't mind me, I'm just a mess. Okay, lunch time, let's go. My lunch for today is just going to be quite random because it is consisted of the three items that we have left in our fridge right now. So I have some cut up sharp cheddar cheese, some Italian salami, some wasabi almonds, a couple of little dill pickles, and then these were sent to me and I've wanted to give them a try. And I've already opened it up and dug in. This is what they look like. Hold on, hold on. They're these little crispy chips made out of egg whites. I guess they're called huevos and they're in the sour cream and onion flavor. They have three net carbs and six grams of fiber. And I have to say, I am pretty impressed with these. They taste pretty good. I have to say they do have a slight powdery feel in your mouth, but overall the flavor and the crispy texture of it is pretty good. So yeah, this is my lunch. Just consists of random items in my fridge because I need to go to the grocery store and I probably won't until we get back from Washington, D.C. Look who I just went and picked up from the groomer. We got a naked bow. Be nice to my naked boy. I'm sorry, bud, but she ain't cute whenever you got a haircut. He is cute, you naked. Oh. Little head, that big old body. <laughs> Cooper, leave him alone. Come here, come here. <laughs> so ugly boy. Look at you, sweet boy. Cooper, leave your brother alone. I ain't no son of mine, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> he looks nothing like me. Y'all look just alike. No. Look at those little happy nubs hoping dad's gonna give him a taco. Yeah, they're gonna keep hoping. <laughs> hey, Bobo. Look at this hawk that's just chilling right here. He's so cool. Oh, there he goes. 
I picked up Bo from his grooming appointment and then Cody got home from work and we needed to pick up some warm clothes for Washington DC this weekend. So I got Cody. Hey y'all. And we're about to go into Belk right there and go shopping and maybe Dillard's too. Oh my God, shopping, shopping, yeah. Okay, bye. bye. <laughs> Let's go shopping. Got the dogs some bones to chew on. Cooper's got one too because he has a tooth that is hanging on by a thread. So I hope that maybe him gnawing on one of these would help get the tooth out because it's sitting up against the roof of his mouth because his other tooth is coming in. So maybe he's going to knock that weird crooked tooth out. Check out this beautiful jacket that Cody bought today at Belk. Oh, very nice. Model it for the YouTube. Oh, he's going to be so warm in Washington, D.C. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, la la. <laughs> he needed him a warm jacket. He got him a warm jacket. Look at him go. Yeah, boy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my golly. Doesn't it look good? 10 out of 10. I think it looks real nice. Oh my God, I think we need to turn off the camera now. He's trying to be a Calvin Klein model. All right, walk on out of here, bye. So the other day I unpacked this duffel bag that was full of stuff and I just kind of threw it over here on the ground because I was too lazy to put it away. Well, all of a sudden Cooper has claimed it as his own and every time he comes in my office, he loves to curl into a ball and sleep on this. I mean, it's just like, a piece of like canvas but he loves it and I need to put it away but I feel bad picking up his bed that he loves to cuddle into <laughs> little sweet baby oh my gosh he is too funny sometimes it's just the little things in life that make you a really happy gal like buying some new sticker books for your planner I love stickers to put in my planner. It just makes it so much more fun to write in your planner and stay on top of everything. So I got some new planner stickers. And then I recently got my new planner for next year. I use the Erin Condren planner. I think this cost me like 55 or 60 bucks. But I put literally everything in here so that I stay on top of knowing what I'm doing all year long. I'm very scatterbrained, and if I don't write it down, I'm gonna forget. So this planner is just one of my favorites. I thought I'd show you the inside in case you're looking for a planner. I get the horizontal layout, and it just gives me so much room to write my to-do list, things I need to do. So I just love this thing, and I'm so excited to use all my new stickers in it. Ah, I'm so excited, y'all. I know, I'm strange. It's the little things in life, okay? You just gotta appreciate them. But I love this cover with the flowers and my name. I love it. I can't wait to stickerify it. <laughs> it is now midnight on the dot. It is late and I don't know where the time went because it was like 7 o'clock and then I looked at the clock and it's now midnight. I swear those five hours didn't happen because I don't think I got anything accomplished. That's great. Anyways, it is midnight and I realize that I'm on day three of not washing my hair and that's about the maximum I can go. So I need to go jump in the shower because there is a lot of dry shampoo in this hair and I need to fix it. So I hope that you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below if you haven't done so. And I will see you tomorrow with another vlog. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.